to say I keep a check She was a How's it going, bros? Today is gonna be a different kind of video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make your very own, your very first YouTube thumbnail. It's amazing, I know. But before we get started with the video, join the Doge Army, please. It's quick, it's easy, it's simple. All you gotta do is press that red subscribe button. It's easy, but let's get started. So the um, the program that you want is called pixlr.com slash x slash editor. It's up here, it's right there. Um, I use this one because it's super easy, it's simple. It's not like Photoshop, but I, because photo, Photoshop costs money and this one's free. So once you want to start you know, with your own YouTube channel, Banner. Uh, banner is you always want to choose web um, 720p right here and then you want to choose the 1280 by 720 that is the YouTube banner and now your background pictures you want them to be 920 by um, 1080 so here you are you have the um, transparent right here and all around here and then you got your tools you got your arrange you can crop you can cut out um, you can adjust, you can uh, filter, you can do filters, you can put effects, you can make stuff weird, you can retouch, you can draw, um, add text, as I use that a lot, you can add um, different stuff, sh stuff, shapes and stuff, and then here is your add image. So what you want to do is you want to find a cool, a cool um, profile, or a cool like, background that suits you so what you can just do is you can search up um what you may call it just search up you always want to have 1920 though 1920 by 1080 backgrounds and then you go to images then you have all of these this Just find one that looks cool. This one looks pretty cool. So you can if one if this 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 will load. Come on, computer. Oh, you know what? Just find just find one. So and when you want to make a thumbnail, you want to make it like you see. Here's all the here's all the videos. Well, I haven't done all that, but then you want to go to save pictures, and here's all the pictures that I use to do my videos um you just find a video that the thing that just suits you um if the th or suits the video not you but I mean the the video like before you saw I was doing like these thumbnails like these and I was just doing that that's because I was but now I'm doing kind of like video things that represent you, but as you can see, I'm not using Photoshop. I this all my thumbnails, our profile picture, and my banner was done right here in this, um, right here in this program. So I'm just gonna find, some find one. Oh, I found one. This is what the one that I used for my last video. For, for one of my other videos. As you can see, it fits perfectly. Now, of course, you want to uh, make sure for copyright because the pictures say maybe, maybe trouble for copyright or something. But I mean, I take the risks. But so, yeah, you just, you have your video. Here, you have your, um, you have your background. And then. I grab, of course, because my channel slogan is a Superman Minecraft skin. This is all how you. This is all my secrets of making it. And you want to go to remove. You basically. This is just how to make like a cool thumbnail. A video that you want. 
but so um something else that you want so then you can trim it off right here I'm letting you guys on my secrets you're not supposed to know this but you do I and I just fail and then of course to restart you just go like that but I just like this program because come on bro I just like this program because it's uh, easy to do for beginners and I was a beginner but I mean I'm getting better at making thumbnails I'm getting faster this is just like a brought up video just to like I don't know show you how to do it but so once you have all this done of course my channel is called dabbing doges so what you can do is you can make this and I just put this in my corner a corner you can size it it shows you all everything you have there top and then you have your layers over here of course the doge head the core of my oops right click the core of my channel this this is the, like different layers there and then you have that right then you could put a title like th so like like this then you can add text I'm just gonna put this over there for now because we're gonna be using that later oops Make sure everything's aligned we can just add this somewhere over here I'm basically just replicating one of my video ones trust me this is not like pre-recorded I actually did this at 7:24 p.m. which is why the videos have gone out late sorry but then you just find a speech bubble I just found a speech bubble what just happened I just found a speech bubble and then here's another cool feature about this um, this program is that it has you can draw your cutout and you can change the um well make sure wait make sure you're on this layer though because watch if I just go to um this layer it'll take that out and you don't want to take that out so yeah just close that up so then you can go here and then you can go to your remove again make sure you're on that layer and as long as it's in like did you did you guys see my the true background videos thumbnail how it has like the dark areas and stuff yeah yeah you you didn't notice that I oopsied on that did you because it was dark so best suit like this see I'm making mistakes but you never know. But yeah, so you just trim it, trim it as best you can, and then once you're f and then once you're finished, you can like um just fix it, fix it, Felix. And then I'm just trimming this. Another thing, a cool thing about this program is um it's easy to use everything the directions are is like laid out it's super simple and straightforward to use which i like because i don't want photoshop and then i'm gonna have to like i don't even know how to work photoshop i didn't even know how to work this in the beginning but now look at me guys i'm doing good 430 subscribers guys that that's crazy that's a crazy See, and then you're just fixing it. Like that. See, in this white background, no one will know. So it's okay to make minimal mistakes on on your thumbnails, but you just don't want them noticeable. Like, do your absolute best on trying to um, keep this from being noticed because then if your thumbnails are sloppy then people are gonna think your videos are sloppy 
and you're not they're not gonna watch the videos are they and if you want to make money off of this then you can't have sloppy videos you have to you want to make your fans you want to appreciate your fans by giving them better content um for me i hope i have improved content for you guys like you saw you saw my first video the hello neighbor video where it was like every second like first we need to get these boxes yeah i stopped doing that surprisingly i stopped doing that i um got myself a new chair i bought myself a mic so i i've done a lot of stuff to improve content for you guys but now this is where the text comes from so look you can basically say just like i and then you do one of these i i made i made this you want to make sure your um titles are catchy as well your thumbnail titles and you also you also uh, want to pick a color that stands out like so i do if i'm anything in white i do black like right here honey mommy no it's not working sometimes it, sometimes this layer won't work but so i'm just gonna add some new text i'm just gonna say hold on i'm just gonna type this in real fast There we go. And hopefully, will it stick? I think it might be sticking. And then if I just put black, it is! Woohoo! So, and then you, you, you can even tilt it. You'll be like, I, I made this? What? I've never made this before. Maybe. And then you can just, and then look at this. Of course says what well, what am i going to say see even i have to think of stuff it's it's hard to make these thumbnails it's no it's no easy work but it it doesn't have to be hard i'm hashtag not sponsored by this program and i might be biased but i like this program and you should use it but sadly i'm hashtag not sponsored so it's just me saying this and also, if I some if you somehow watching this, you should, you should give me a sponsor sponsorship. How about that? Yeah. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty cool. So then what am I gonna type? I'm just gonna type Doge makes a shopping. Mall in oops. Oh, in Roblox. Boom. Then a particular one I like to use, it's, it's born hard. I really like this one because it's super big, it's super clear. But for these kinds of stuff where you want to put it in small spaces, I'd recommend, um, I'd recommend, uh, this one, Blaine's Burley. I would not want to do this one because it's clear and it makes it look super weird. That one is like pirates, so I don't know. I would use that one but I mean it's it's basically your, your own preference and then look you're finished and oh my god there's a save button right there oh no it's saved right there how this couldn't be more simple more simple and then I will show off all the other stuff. There's literally shapes. Shapes. 
I used this one in my first thumbnails, if you recognize this. It's like, subscribe. I don't do that anymore. Because of... For the first two videos, I've outgrown of it. And then you could draw. Nani! Nani, 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 Look. Nani! And the best one of all. Eh. Yeah. Yeet. You guys are the best. Peace out.